Hey, what's going on everybody? Toxic Misfits here, also known as Bipolar Gamer, if you follow our main channel. Today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can merge racing gloves, any kind of racing gloves you lock onto any outfit with Save Editor, no BEFF required, and you just need a friend and watch your job, basically, and that's all you need to do. I recommend it's a G-Thing job and buying the apartment closest to the gun store. But to get the switch started, we need to create ourselves a merge swap. If you're on a male character, which I'm assuming most people will be, I'll be showing you what to do. What you want to do, do you want to go in here and make your outfit? So we're going to go to male character here. I didn't have everything picked out. So you just pick out what you want here and basically the same thing. I don't have this ready here. I'm just want to add gloves. So what we're going to do, if your character is male, we're going to switch to multiplayer female, free mode 01, and we're going to go down the gloves. And we need to put a higher texture item on this character, and this will allow you to create a magic swat. And I'll be showing you guys how you can actually use the magic clock. So we're going to put in texture 16 at the top, and we're going to put down texture 3 at the bottom. This here, this here basically gives you these gloves here. And what you want to do now is you just want to immediately save the outfit. Do not change anything else. You will lose the magic swat. Then you simply just put this here in the save editor, and we will return to the game, game over here. And I'll show you guys here in a second when I get the merge swap ready. And one more thing I forgot to mention. You do not want to bring the outfit with the merge gloves right on right away because we need to make our magic swap first. You'd just be wasting your time doing it because you'll lose your merge swap. Now, pretty much what we're going to be doing here is I'm just going to put a different color outfit on here first. And then we'll go, we'll go from there. So I'm just going to pick something here. And I'll show you guys how to make the Mazer Squat. It is very, very easy to do. And one more thing I forgot to mention. Bring on a different outfit other than the merge outfit for right now. Because we're going to be splitting the Biker Gloves off the outfit. Where the race gloves or any gloves you want. You bring on the merge outfit now. You're going to have to bring it on again. So it's kind of just counterintuitive. So we want to just go ahead and just bring this on. What I mean by splitting the gloves off the outfit is the black biker suit will not work. So we'll be looking for an outfit like this that has the gloves on it. That way we can pull the gloves off of it with the magic swap we created and save editor. So I'll be bringing on my blue swat outfit. So we're just going to go to the time trial and switch to Michael. And I have a cool trick for you guys to make sure that you can get your pet outfits online a little bit faster actually. And how to check it's ready to go online so you do not get frozen in the cloud. And I just found this out every day and I wish I would have known it a long time ago. And if you guys are looking for GTA 5 modern services then check out this ad right here and get them from us. And if you guys are tired of not having the best clothing items, the most money in the game, frozen money saved, your modded accounts, we just don't want to do these stupid and slow glitches anymore any of that travel we just need some quick cash for rank up and just reach out to us and we'll personally do it for you we're the most legit and cheapest on the market so just reach out about the worst place you could spawn a pet is in front of franklin's house or michael's house so we're gonna run away and we're gonna hope this thing splits right here okay it's split now what you want to do after the pet splits is pause the game if it says zero dollars in the corner you can ask for just go unwind right now, guys. You do not have to switch to Trevor or anything. Just as long as it says zero dollars in the corner. Now, if there's money in the corner, you're going to have to switch to Trevor and switch back and then go unwind. But I found this out every day, and this has helped me a lot. It also got to a solo session. You just waste some time going in by the only session unless you're trying to save a devil back. So just don't even waste your time with that. Because I think I've timed it, the in by the only session and just five to fifteen seconds slower than so you guys can see here i'm literally already online now what we need to do from here is we want to go ahead and go to a cloven store do not change anything on the outfit you will lose your magic slot so do not do that and we're going to be looking for an item that's available on both characters so 
And you can just switch from your male to female characters to see if like that shirt's available or whatever. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about here in a second. But first of all, we're gonna save this outfit here. This is the nun merge outfit. So we're gonna go to tops, and I'm gonna save it because I asked for you guys to replace it earlier. Okay, now what we wanna do is we wanna go over here to the counter, and we're gonna find an outfit with the gloves on that we want here. So we're gonna go to biker stage. And you can use any of the gloves here, like the blue, the uh, yellow, the French, this Italian. Now the green and the red, and I think the pink's available in Save Wizard, by the way, so there's no point in getting that. So we're gonna get the black, the black gloves, and we're gonna walk over here to the torso, so the cloven, the tops, basically, and we're gonna look for a item that is available on both characters here. So usually this is labels. And you need to make sure the gloves come on the outfit. And you guys can see here the gloves are on the outfit because this session is glitched. So we want to make sure these items are available on both characters. So I actually have two consoles. I'm going to check to make sure this is available here. Yep, the lot sweater is available on female. As long as the shirt is available on both characters, you can use it. If it's not available in both characters, it's blacklist that we're going to do. We're going to equip the shirt, and we're going to save it in the magic slots. So we're going to put gloves. Now, this outfit should not delete from here, because these items will be available on both characters. Now, for example, the black backer seat, it will delete because it's actually Christmas items or limited edition items. That's why it will delete. Now, you want to make sure that you do save this outfit before you leave, or you will lose it. Now we can exit from here, and we can bring our merge outfit online. Okay, now we're gonna be bringing our merge outfit online, and you will need a friend to invite you to you. this job called Slow and Low, or it's a G thing. The Fleeka job will not work, Hostel or Visa will not work, anybody that says it does, it's completely retarded and they're a bot. Because those jobs are only for belt mergers. Now these jobs, it's a G thing and slow and low will work. Personally, I recommend it's a G thing because you can spawn in your MKT. There's no one at level. You just need to get to your apartment in under 40 minutes, basically. So I do have two consoles myself, so I can actually invite myself once I bring the pet online here. So congrats to me for being smart. If you're a real modder, you need two consoles. If you don't have two consoles, you're just wasting your time, basically. Alright, what we're gonna be doing from here, it's just running away, and we're gonna split the pad as normal, and hopefully it does work. Yep, it should work now. We're gonna check and see if it says zero. It does. Now we're gonna go to an invite-only session, because we will be getting invited. I'm gonna switch to my second console and invite myself here. Fortunately, I cannot show us here, so just online, play, bookmark, jobs, missions, it's a G thing. Y'all haters just mad you can't get any killer joggers. Ha! <laughs> and murder it. They're friends and it's a G thing job. Or if you're in it, make sure to switch it to player owned outfits. So that's basically all we need to do here. Okay, I'm joining the job here. I could switch back to the every console. And make sure you have that merge outfit saved in slot 1 or 20. Because you will need plots, by the way. Player saved outfits, again, important. Now we're going to switch, since it's in SWAT 1, you guys see I don't have the gloves, switch to the right, switch to the left, and bam, look at that guys, we got the big bad race gloves on here, HA, <laughs> got him. Now you will notice your helmet does disappear, I don't know why this is, I think I have a fix, because sometimes the color helmets will disappear and they won't come back, and sometimes they won't. If this happens, you can actually walk in the garage, but honestly, I recommend saving this merge outfit twice. So I would save it before you even go in the job. If you have a duffel bag especially, and you will have to actually use a glitch to transfer the duffel bag from the first outfit to the outfit with the gloves, because you guys can see there, the duffel bag did disappear. And sometimes it does not come back when you go in free mode. So we're just gonna just make our way to our apartment. My apartment is, is up here. But if you guys are merging multiple outfits, you can buy an apartment right in this area. And I would just recommend doing that. Because you do have a time limit. So I would recommend doing that. It would save you a little bit of time. We may be talking 30 seconds or minutes saved. But that's a lot of time when you're trying to bring like 10 outfits on one. Oops, went to the wrong apartment. So I don't know why you can't buy apartments in this building. If you guys do not have the boy boy up over here. 
all you have to do is just blow yourself up. Uh, we're just gonna pick one of my eight equipped tires apartments here. Who needs the neighbors when you can own it all? Now what you wanna do is you just wanna just make your way over here and save your outfit basically. Probably better to use the penthouse because it's easier to get to the cloven room. Let's save this here and swap one black down. Now this here is easier to do with a black outfit compared to BEFL because right here this is done. These are fake joggers by the way. They are the Secure Serve joggers. Secure Serve 2 I believe. But they look very very close to the real joggers so nobody really notices. And what we're going to do now is exit the phone and this outfit should have saved. Just make sure you save it inside of your apartment. And you can do this with uh, a bunch of other items. Now you guys will notice you will spawn in story mode and you will not have the gloves. That's no big deal. All you gotta do is just switch to it. And you guys can see here I did lose the duffel bag. So if you're going for the duffel bag, I would go ahead and save that outfit at the mask store before you come into the merge job. I just think it'll be easier if you can do that. If it, if you do lose your merge swap, you just have to just bring the duffel bag outfit on again. And do like glitch, you put the Russian Federation bag on the outfit you want. You just fly in the sky and you come back down. But y'all guys, that's pretty much it for the video. That's how you can easily get race gloves on any outfit. And you can merge any gloves you want. There's different items for different merge slots. I'll be showing a video how to merge joggers and merge tops and everything like that later on. I just have to just make the video. I'm about to go ahead and record it here nuts. But this is pretty much going to be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll see everybody next time. Peace out.